Hello hey everyone, today I'll show you why the derivative of the absolute value of x equals x divided by the absolute value of x. But first of all, what is the absolute value of x? Well, the absolute value of x is defined this way. x if x is greater or equal to 0 and minus x if x is less than 0. Notice that the absolute value of x is always positive. But this is not the only definition of it, because the absolute value of x equals the square root of x squared. Those definitions are equivalent, but let's focus on the second one. So the derivative of the absolute value of x equals the derivative of the square root of x squared. Since the absolute value of x and the square root of x squared are equal. So this equals the derivative of x squared to the one half's power, right? And to differentiate this function, we can use the chain rule. So this is just one halves times x squared to the one halves minus one power times the derivative of x squared, that is 2x. Now we can simplify 2 and 2, and this equals x squared to the 1 halves minus 1 is just minus 1 halves times x. So this equals x divided by x squared to the 1 halves power, that is x divided by the square root of x squared. Notice that the square root of x squared is just the absolute value of x. So this equals x over the absolute value of x. And notice that the absolute value of x is not differentiable as x equals 0, because its derivative x divided by the absolute value of x is not defined at x equals 0. So x can be equal to 0. And from the first definition of absolute value, the derivative of the absolute value of x equals 1 if x is greater than 0 and minus 1 if x is less than 0. If you enjoyed my video, leave a thumbs up, share this video with your friends. Until next time, bye!